Hello everyone and welcome back to the Neon Revolution. Today's episode, very, very, very excited about. We talked about it in the last episode. Today we have a Hidden Fates Elite Trainer Box. I've only opened one of these and I paid so much money for it. I think I paid 180 for it because, you know, that's what people do online. Uh, I somehow found this at a store for MSRP, which is just absolutely crazy. Um, I found two of them. I bought both of them. Now, if anybody who's followed me for a long enough time knows, I do not buy out the store. I hate it when I go to a store and everything is gone. It makes it very hard for people who are doing this or, you know, like I, I know a couple of people who do this um, because they have kids and their kids are super into it. Um, but so we'll jump right into this today. So comes with a player's guide, gives you some rules and then the card list and of the card list, I mean, we, we got, we got a lot of chase cards in this set and I've only opened a, a handful of these, maybe, but that's the card. That's the card we want right there. Charizard GX. As of today, the most recent sale of one Sold for $1,700 for a PSA 10. And that's absolutely insane. So we got the three legendary birds, Mew, Shiny Mewtwo, and Shiny Charizard. This is the artwork on the inside of the pack. If anybody didn't know that, now you do. Beautiful box textured. I don't know if you guys can see that, but all those Right there, that's all texture, right there. Got the legendary birds right there. All right, and this is what I like to see when I open a uh, Elite Trainer box, is all the packs are still over on the one side because, I mean, during the shipping process, I think they have a mosh pit in the back of the truck when it's on its way to uh, the store. So what do we got, 10? 10, 10 in this one, three, six, nine, 10. 10 packs today. All right, what else we got? This is This is what we're after right here too. This is what we're after. If this comes back PSA 10, I'll put the uh, price on the screen, but just for a promo card that comes in every single Elite Trainer box, it's just absolutely insane. And it's a beautiful, I mean, beautiful card. This one and the one from Small But Mighty are two of my absolute favorite promo cards of all time. You're going to set that off to the side, leaving it in the plastic. You also get card sleeves right there. <coughs> Excuse me, 50 of them. You get dividers, four of them. And then you get a whole bunch of energy cards right there, nice and sealed up. Tokens for the game and dice for the game if you are into playing it. But all of that is going to go back in there for now. And slide that back on top. And absolutely beautiful. All right. So we've got 10 packs to open. Like I said, I've only opened this set once or twice before. So I am very, very excited to see what we can get out of here. Hopefully we pull a Charizard. So let's move to the close up and start opening some Pokemon cards. All right, everyone, we are back. Just the camera, get situated right there. We're gonna start off with the shiny Charizard pack art right there. We're gonna hopefully pull the Charizard first first pack. Now it's been a very long time. I cannot remember for the life of me if it is three or four cards. Uh, one, two, three, four. Let's do four. Let's see what happens. All right. Starting off, we've got Caterpie, Paris. Psyduck, Charmander, Magikarp, Energy, get that out of there, Jinx, Charmeleon, now alright, so a Charmander and a Charmeleon, is it a sign? A Charizard, out of a Charizard pack with a Charmander and a Charmeleon, can it be true? Chansey... And okay, all right. So reverse hollow is not the Charizard. Um, it is, a, you know, a shiny energy card. But last card of the pack, an electrode. All right. So we will go ahead, 
sleeve these up. We'll add them to our collection. I don't think we have either one of them. So honestly, it is a good pack. Nonetheless, had me hopeful though. Not gonna lie. We still got nine more packs. Nine more chances to go. All right, let's see what we get. So one, two, three, four was correct. We'll toss those back there. All right, we got Coughing, Voltorb, Cubone, Geodude, Eevee, Energy. We'll get that out of there. Scyther, Metapod. Looks like it's getting uh, chased down by Pick a Peck there. Magmar. And Arbok as the reverse hollow. It is a rare, so a good pull right there. And Jesse and James holographic. I will take it. And you got uh, James, or uh, excuse me, Jesse in the background there. All right. Toss those over there ever so gently. All right, now looking at this one, the whole bottom, look at that. Maybe we got some miscut cards in there. Who knows? Very interesting. Very, very interesting. I don't think any of the other... Yeah, none of the other um, cards are like that. I know if you uh, do get miscut cards, sometimes sell them to the right person that they can be worth more than a normal card so one two three and four from the back no shinies just yet that's okay we got plenty of packs to go cubone ev clefairy psyduck having one of his headaches ekans looking at a rainbow misty's determination is that Metapod, Charmeleon, and Electrode as the Reverse Hollow. So we know we have both of the Electrodes, the Normal and the Reverse Hollow. And oh my god, we have pulled Moltres, Zapdos, Articuno, GX, Rainbow Rare. I am so sorry for whoever is wearing headphones listening to this right now. Oh my god. God, yes. That this is this is one of the chase cards from this set. And I I'm whoo, whoo, at a loss for words. I'm not taking any chances. We are double sleeving that up as gently. We're gonna do little taps, we're gonna get it in there. Nice, nice absolutely amazing i am so happy that i drove to this random walmart out in the middle of nowhere oh wow look look at how beautiful that card is now it is different uh than this one right here in terms of like where they are placed and stuff like that but uh oh wow yeah i i really do apologize for screaming it's been uh been an interesting ride on this channel so far just look oh wow look at that all right let's turn it over come on be be good be good this oh centering maybe just a, a little bit off but depending on how much off it is it can still come back a psa 10 um i, I know they do allow for like one tiny little you know imperfection and stuff like that. Now, if you wanted to go to like Beckett, get a Beckett uh, black. Uh, great, I'm I'm still at a loss words. So yeah, Beckett black uh, graded ten. It has to be absolutely perfect, like 100%, no flaws anywhere. And this, I mean, whew. All right, listen, I if we don't pull the Charizard today, I am completely, completely okay with that. That is absolutely phenomenal. I, I wish I wish you guys could see the smile on my face. I, I am working on a studio. Um, I've talked about it in a couple of the other episodes. Uh, everything costs more right now because of uh, COVID and stuff. Uh, lumber costs more. Just building materials in general costs more. And I could set it up right now. But uh, when I when me and my uh, my girlfriend moved into this house uh, with our son, 
we uh, have a basement, and that's where we're building the uh, studio. But uh, we we nicknamed it when we first moved in the murder room because that's that's what it looks like. It, it it's got petrified wood in it, no joke, petrified wood as like the walls and stuff. It was apparently reclaimed wood from like a barn from like you know the 1800s, which is cool. It is. But I can't even drive a nail into it to hang anything on, so it's uh, it's some serious business. All right, so enough about that. So all right, Jinx and Atkins as the Reverse Hollow and a Kangaskhan as the Rare. Uh, still, I mean, no shinies, which is which is kind of weird. But you know what? Honestly, after that uh, that last that that oh, last pull. I can't even talk. I'm so happy. Um, yeah, absolutely, uh, absolutely amazing, amazing day of collecting Pokemon cards. Um, especially because we had a we had a rut on the channel. For those who watch all my videos, we had a rut where we uh, we did not get any good pulls. I, it was almost 20 episodes worth. I mean, we'd get maybe one full art, but if you looked at it like, oh, if I get it graded and it comes back to PSA 10. Fifteen dollars, twenty dollars, stuff like that. So uh, it was, it was, it was getting kind of rough. And then for some reason, I was like, "Oh, I'll go to Dollar General," and I started picking up some of their tins. And we started pulling. We pulled a, a Rainbow Rare uh, Tyranitar out of one. We pulled Secret Rares from XY Evolutions. I mean, we were just getting amazing luck, and that turned it around. We've had great luck so far since then. So I mean, knock on wood. All right, Pokemon Center Laney, Sabrina's Suggestion, and a Lapras Reverse Hollow, another Reverse Hollow Rare, and a Mr. Mime. Okay. Okay. Completely okay. I'm, I'm just, I'm still just in awe of that, uh, that pull. I'm sorry I keep bringing it up, but, uh, wow. Yeah. I was the same way when I pulled, uh... The Charizard VMAX Rainbow Rare from, oh god, it's escaping me now, it was the Champion's Path. And uh, I, I pulled it the first pack of the episode, too. So, uh, and I just, I couldn't, I couldn't stop, you know, believing that I was lucky enough to, to pull it. So, alright, we got Geodude, Eevee, Clefairy, Caterpie. I also like how all these are like the old school Pokemon. Like, ah, I appreciate the the original 151. That, that's kind of what I grew up with. I, that's actually exactly what I... Pokemon came out when I was in third grade. That's how old I am. So, Sabrina's Suggestion. Charmeleon. And a shiny Quagsire. There you go. Look at you, you beautiful thing. Absolutely amazing. I was wondering if we were going to get any shinies today. I'm happy that it's a shiny Quagsire. What do we got behind you? A holographic Misty's Water Command. So, I'll, I, you know, I will take that all day. Go ahead, sleeve that up. Go ahead, sleeve you up. A couple tap taps. Get it in there. Uh, to anybody who's not aware, uh, the reason I tap it once I get it to a certain point is um, I don't want to push it down and create a crease on the top of the card. Um, I don't want to damage the card in any way. Beautiful, beautiful looking card. And we'll sleeve up Misty's Water Command. So far, so good. What a good day. One shiny, one rainbow rare. And if it was going to be a rainbow rare, I, I mean, that's probably the one that I'd want. Whew, what a day. I'm just now catching my breath after screaming. I'm sure my dog and my son are very confused listening from, you know, the living room. All right. Slowpoke. Psyduck. Pikachu. Magikarp. Coughing. Energy. Barak's Grit, Koga's Trap, 
Misty's Cerulean City Gem. All right, and what's behind it? A full art Jakari GX. Look at you. Oh, wow. What is going on? Another shiny. Look, oh, wow. Okay. Today's a great day. So good. I am so happy. What do we got behind you? A Clefable. I'm okay with that. All right. What a day. What a day. All right. Let's go ahead. Double sleeve you up. Let's take a look at you. Let's look at the centering. Left to right looks good at the top. On the bottom it looks good. Maybe just a bit high. You see the space up there versus the space down there. But again, it, I don't know. It could still be a PSA 10, which I am okay with. Now to the new subscribers that I do have, again, thank you guys for joining the channel. I do appreciate it. Um, I put up the PSA 10 prices. Uh, it kind of keeps me a little bit sane. I like to believe that uh, all my cards are going to come back PSA 10. Um, it also lets anybody who's trying to get into the hobby know that there, there can be some serious money made in this. All right, so we got Ekans, Cubone, Magikarp, Geodude, Clefairy, Energy, get that out of there. Scyther, one of my old school favorites. That would be in my uh, in my team, going up against the Elite Four. And a Jolteon, another Reverse Hollow Rare. We are killing it today. And another Kangaskhan, all right. I'm okay with that. All duplicates on this channel are loved and then immediately sold to continue funding. Uh, at this point, honestly, it's just my gas bill of driving around to all these different stores because you never know what store got restocked on what day uh, from what vendor. You know, sometimes you're like, all right, well, I'm just going to drive you know, an hour and a half in one direction to find a Walmart in the middle of a field so that you can pull these amazing cards. All right, Evie. Caterpie, Paris, Ekans, Psyduck, Energy, Brock's Grit, Misty's Cerulean City Gem, Chansey, and Brock's Pewter City Gem as the Reverse Hollow. I'm alright with that. I'm alright with that. And an Onyx GX Ultra Rare. What a day for collecting Pokemon cards. What a day. What a day. Go ahead. Sleeve that up. And we have actually... Oh, you gotta sleeve this one too. We have made it all the way to the last card of the pack. Or, uh, excuse me, last uh, pack of the day. I'm still very dumbfounded by our luck today. Full art shiny and full art rainbow rare card. What an amazing elite trainer box. And I have one more and it's killing me not to just open it right now, but we have to save it for another episode. All right, Slowpoke, Charmander. Will this be the Charizard? Will this be like the best elite trainer box that's ever existed ever? Pikachu, playing in some bubbles. Voltorb, coughing. It's doing it again to us. There's the Charmeleon. Will there be a Charizard? Will there be a Charizard? Rockscript. And a gold card, Tapu Finny. What is going on with this Elite Trainer box? What are the chances that we pull this many? Amazed look at this card. What is going on? I am so confused. Oh my god. Alright. Alright. What's behind it? Alright, a, a non-holographic Snorlax. That's alright. Snorlax, that's fine. I am completely okay with you existing back there. Look at that card. What is going on today? Look, look at it. 
absolutely phenomenal. The centering looks, I mean, as far as I like those, it looks great on the front. Let's check out the back. Yeah. Oh yeah. That that's another that that's definitely a PSA 10. If this comes back as anything less than a PSA 10, I'm quitting collecting Pokemon cards because I apparently don't know anything. Uh, centering looks good. There's no whitening. Uh, the corners look crisp. I mean, I I I don't even know what's going on today. Uh, so yeah, that's uh that's today's episode. Let's go back through. And uh, all right, we'll start. We'll start here. Onyx, GX, uh, two shinies. There are shinies right there. Full art, Jakari, GX, and a Quagsire. Uh, both shiny, both amazing. And then these two right here. I mean, what are the chances that we get both in one? I mean, this is just wow. I, I can't even. I can't even put it into words, honestly. Um, yeah, that's uh, whoo, that's crazy. As my camera freaks out, I apologize about that. But uh, yeah, wow, what a day! And and I mean, on top of that, most of our reverse hollows were reverse hollow rares. I mean, reverse hollow rare, hollow rare, reverse hollow rare, reverse hollow rare, reverse hollow rare, and then I mean, I think those are pretty rare too. Um, so. Yeah, this is gonna be. Uh, whoo! Wow, we definitely uh, definitely made our money back. Even if we d don't get these graded and just sell them at like face value, whatever those are. I mean, we definitely made our money back. But that is not why we do this. We do this for the absolute love of collecting these beautiful pieces of artwork. I mean, one last time, just look at that. And if not that one, I mean, the promo card alone makes it worthwhile comes back PSA 10. I think it's around like $400 the last time I looked. I mean, it could change. It could go up. It could go down. But, uh, I mean, you're buying it for $50 if you can get it for $50. And uh, you get it graded. So however much, you know, you spend to get it graded. And then, yeah, sell it for $400. Crazy. Absolutely crazy. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to today's amazing episode of collecting Pokemon cards. I mean, just such a good episode. Uh, to all my new subscribers, again, thank you guys so much for joining the revolution. It means more than you can ever know. Um, to all my old school subscribers, thank you for sticking around as long as you have. And as always, everyone, thank you so very much. It means the world. It really does. Have an amazing day.